Hello, everybody. Welcome to a special edition of SBR's March Madness coverage. I'm SBR Justin. And I'm Matt. And we're here with a show today about animals picking basketball games. Now, this is not the first time we've seen animals pick sporting events, but World Series, the Super Bowl, snakes, octopi, etc. We figured, yeah, we're SBR. You know, we've got resources. We're here in Costa Rica. There's tons of animals. Yeah, and um, have you guys ever seen a monkey pick March Madness brackets before? let alone four different monkeys. Four different monkeys. So we found four monkeys, one for each region. One a specialist in each region, we should say. So, and we've got one monkey in particular um, giving us a couple spread picks mm -hmm. on a couple of the short line games, some of the, I think, that are gonna be the best games in, uh, in this first round. So without further ado. So let's introduce the monkeys. Let's introduce the monkeys. Jorge runs the show here, and he has mad street cred for his sordid past of lower primate trafficking. Apparently, he also really knows how to pick college basketball games, though that remains to be proven. Teresita tries to keep the unnecessary monkey business to a minimum. She didn't only learn how to cuss like a mechanic with Tourette's, but she can fix an animal enclosure with the best of them. El Guapo is the baby boy of the group, and boy is he a looker. He actually auditioned for the A-team to play face, but did not have the charisma Bradley Cooper did. Nala is a loner. She's a bit of a monkey misanthrope, or whatever you'd call a monkey who dislikes the company of other primates. Is there even a word for that? Hey guys, how's it going again? This is SBR Justin. And Matt. And Rodolfo. <laughs> and Rodolfo with the yeah. Refugio Hepatologico Animal Rescue here in Costa Rica. And we're here to do some monkey business. We got a bunch of monkeys over here. We have a bracket right here. We have uh, equally placed flags with the bracket pick on them. And a little piece of fruit. So what we'll do is we'll get this close to the monkey and whichever flag they take will be the pick. One of these two teams, whoever wins the play-in, will either lose or win against UNC. Nala. Oh yeah, oh, she wants UNC, she knows. Favorite. She knows it. Yeah, girl. All right, she's the winner. Boom! <laughs> Boom, don't take UNC. Smart move. Yeah. monkey doesn't count because he actually came in from the side so he only had an angle of SF Austin so that one's that's not it. So now we move on to the Midwest, and we have El Guapo, the handsome one. He's the one that, you know, he got beat out by Bradley Cooper. He's a little pissed about it, and this is his big chance. So here we go. El Guapo. 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 Yeah, you like to Come on, Virginia. Virginia. Yeah. Liking the favorites. We actually have a pick on this game too, an ATS pick after the fact. Gonzaga Tenton Hall. We also have a, a, a ATS pick on this. Dayton. Dayton Flyers with Syracuse. The orange. Jorge, he's the leader of the group and he is the self-proclaimed basketball expert. He's the one who knows all about basketball. And his first pick is going to be Kansas versus Austin Pay. 
Let's see how it goes. Jorge, Jorge, Jorge. Who do you got? Who do you got? Oh, he's got Kansas. Smart move. He, he knows his stuff. <laughs> Betting this one, you might want to take the jackrabbits on the uh, on the the, on the line. bread line, but Maryland's gonna come out on top. Really taking his time on this. He does. Yeah. He likes going over. See, he even reads. Uh, <laughs> he might know what he's talking about. I think he does. Now we're on to the west. We've got a new monkey, Teresita, and one of the monkeys stole our Oregon flag, so we made a makeshift Oregon flag. So it's avocado. Right. Versus, oh, that's not avocado. An avocado. No, that's enough. Oregon. Oh, <laughs> Oregon. Of all the no, ones. Number to one take. seed. Holy Cross or Southern versus Oregon. One of these two teams are going to play in and face Oregon. So who will win? Let's check it Let's out. Let's find here, out. Teddy. 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 Teddy covers. Teddy, Teddy. Teddy covers. Teddy. Okay, Teddy. <laughs> Oregon. Oh, he likes Oregon. Oh, he thought about one of the playing teams for a second. She thought about one of the playing teams for a second there. <laughs> She's so good. She has nice manners. Look at that. Wasn't grabbing. Teddy cover. Doing well. Good job, Teddy. Sorry to everybody in Bakersfield. Yeah. <laughs> it's got one of us on some crap. Oh! Not a fan of Bakersfield either. There you have it, folks. We have our March Madness monkey business bracket all picked out by the locals here. And uh, we have uh, some bonus picks. The monkey's are actually going to do a couple spread picks. So now that you have your bracket all figured out, we have four ATS spread picks. Who do uh, we got? Zaga Seton Hall, ATS. From Tere Covers. He likes Zags. All right. Tere likes the Zags. Uh, Pitt versus Wisconsin. Wisconsin is favored by one and a half points. Let's see who the monkey's like. Oh, they like Wisconsin. Like they just jumped for it. Syracuse and Dayton. The lines are out as a pick 'em right now. Let's try to get uh, Nala to get this one. Nala. Let's try to get two and two. Nala. Teddy wants to make your picks. Where with Teddy? <laughs> you got to push on that one. Oh man! Yeah, 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 yeah. Nah, yeah. Are you coming out, man? Are they fighting? Last one, guys. Come on, hold it together. UConn versus Colorado. It's a four-point spread. Oh my God, they love Colorado. Colorado. Oh, 
Colorado, minus four. The final pick. Good job, guys. Good picking. All right, so the monkeys cooperated. We have four ATS picks for you, which you'll see in the article as well, and we'll have links to everything. And even though we joke around about, about the monkeys, they have really had a tough life. Yeah, absolutely. And uh, these guys here, they've given them a home. So these monkeys, I'd, I'd, correct me if I'm wrong, but they can't exist out in the wild anymore. They're injured yeah. for various reasons. Mm -hmm. I think of all kinds of animals there. There's uh, crocodiles, turtles. They really do a great job here. So uh, we are gonna include a graphic in this video where you can help them out by donating. Yeah, if these monkeys make you some freaking money on your bracket or on your ATS picks, <laughs> feel free to give a little bit of the proceeds to these guys here because it really is a big help. They are um, bringing kids in oh, to help yeah, with the animal conservation. Um, and yeah, like you these, said... These monkeys are working in environmental education for the other ones. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They, these monkeys are helping the rest of the monkeys here in Costa Rica and other animals as well. And they do need to be maintained and it is not cheap. So um, every little bit helps. So check out the website, we'll put it in the description below. We'll probably put a uh, PayPal, got me or a PayPal link mm -hmm. in there if you want to donate a couple bucks. And uh, stay tuned because next week we'll see the results, we'll get to track these monkeys, we'll see how they picked, how well they did, and then we'll put them against the other people of similar IQ, i.e. Jordan Sharp, Mike Brenner, Peter Loschek, no, I'm just kidding. Their, their IQ is better than the, the monkeys, but, <laughs> and us, ourselves, our social media picks as well. We have the round of 32, so they're going to pick again and we're gonna track these guys through the entire tournament. Absolutely. All right, we're Thanks out of here. Thanks for coming out, guys.